Make sure that in the collected walk, you already feel the opportunity of the collected canner. And not just the collected canner, but the best collected canner. So what you feel inside of the electricity in the walk, you feel in your, in your canner, right? That you already know that the canner is gonna be connected and framed just right, right? Yep, quite good. That's quite good. Super. Good. Good. Well done. Yep. And then a little bit forward and back a couple of times, showing the sort of the rubber band exercise. Good. And then the back and, and the back. Keep your leg a little more under you. And in the back, Sophia, he's not to slow his rhythm down. He's actually, if anything, going to speed his rhythm a little bit up again, you know, and like, like jump a little faster, faster up the right hind, faster up the right hind. So you think, could I bring him? Yeah, you feel the rhythm of that? The rhythm of your on the spot should be the same rhythm as the extended canner, okay? Good boy, that was better. That was better. You felt the little bounce to that, right? Okay, and once more. The rhythm of the on the spot is the rhythm of the, of the extended canner for him, okay? Good boy, and pet him for that. Yes, super, okay. Let's now go and change the rein and do the same thing the other way. Make sure you're gonna hit the flying change really well, inner leg, outer rein on a four tempi, okay? Make sure that in the, in before you come on the diagonal, you think of that on the spot right here, on the spot. Good, good, jumping, jumping. Now round, okay, did you want it that early? So that's all right, circle around to the left. Good, good. He, you know, he wants it for you. You know what I'm saying? So you never get, you never get after him for that because he wanted it for you. Now you go across saying to yourself in your mind, I'm gonna do a counter canner at the other end. So I'm gonna keep the right lead calmly, I mean the left lead, and I'm gonna wait, and I'm gonna counter canner, and I'm gonna keep it. And then, when you're ready, you say the four tempi, when you're ready, okay? Well done, okay, very well done, super. And now, we'll do the rubber band exercise at this end, okay? Good, and collecting. Good. And again forward, and again back, good, and again forward, and again back, and in this right lead, make him jump a little bit better underneath himself, and yes, and keep your left rein contact stronger, okay? So in other words, he has to be a little bit more, almost like a shoulder in, onto his left rein, all right? Because, so even onto a shoulder in, onto his left rein, not that he's jumping a, a, from your in, inwards like the other way. That's like a leg yielding. Make him get out onto his left rein from your right leg more. Right, right, so he's like, a, yeah, now on the long side, shoulder in, okay? Good, good, you're doing really well. Steady, steady, in steadiness, steadiness. Bend him a little more right. Good, there, see how he came out a little rounder right there? That's, that's better. Now feel that left rein definitely, okay? Super, super. And the collection in the corners, collection going into the corners, okay? Collection going into the corners, good. Collection going into the corners, that's right. And then forward, good. And make him stay on his reins, stay on his reins. Feel the both reins. You know that he's like adjustable, like bending right, feel the reins. He's never to come sort of up and hollow and away from the reins, okay? Never coming up, hollow, or away from the reins. That's it, diagonal. And you take your time and wait for your change. Take your time, push him underneath. Good, and collecting. And again, through your right rein. 